Hi guys, this is Melucci and welcome back to Coden Exiles. So I've been promising, well promising, I've been telling uh, that I'm gonna build up a new floor uh, for the past two days, but yeah, no time, no internet, uh, it's, it's all coming together. But uh, yeah, it's Friday uh, for all you guys uh, that their weekend started. Uh, first off, happy weekend. Uh, hope you're gonna enjoy it. I definitely am gonna enjoy it. So I spent some time uh, Friday. I usually have well, I us not usually Friday. I have uh, I stop working at twelve o'clock instead of two o'clock. So two hours home earlier, and uh, I already started working up. Our last parts are done. Uh, I did want to have the blue and the uh, purple lights, but the purple lights read Radiant Gems. And if we go check out the Radiant Gems, uh, we're actually going to need materials we don't have yet. So Radiant Gem, Crystal, Alchemy Base and Witch Fire Powder. Now, Witch Fire Powder we can do, Glowing Essence and Brimstone. Uh, but the alchemy base actually requires silver dust, gold dust, and ichor. Now we, I have done some research uh, behind this because I know we can find like silver coins and gold coins and silver bars and gold bars uh, uh, in the harbor, uh, the actual harbor over here, and some chests, and then over here in the water as well, uh, and uh, among other places in some other chests. But there are actually deposits you can... That's the wrong box. There are actually deposits you can... Didn't we actually need the witch, fire, uh, witch, witch powder? Let's see, let's see. I think there is something... Yeah, witch fire standing. So actually we do need witch fire. Iron bar and iron bar. Crap! I'm, apparently I'm not done with my preparations for my episode yet. <laughs> So we are able to craft up these two lights, but I basically wanted to bring the glowing wall lights, the radium wall torch, and then the witch fire torches. Because for today's uh, build, we actually need a couple different kind of lights. Not the regular yellow lights, but like colored lights. That's what we needed. Uh, and I don't really know if this light, like this looks blue, this like looks like light bluish. So I'm gonna check out which fighter powder, what do we need? Brimstone and Glowing Essence. Glowing Essence was, I think, like I, like I said, I have done some farming and uh, resource gathering, as you can see. I think it was, and then uh, was Brimstone as well, right? So let's take a couple Brimstone. Uh, no, not the crystal, because that was for the red lights. Uh, but yeah, uh, there, apparently there are deposits you can farm uh the obsidian we have not found the obsidian well i kind of know that the obsidian is on the volcano uh but we haven't explored the volcano yet so we don't have the obsidian yet and you can get gold ore or yeah i think it's called gold ore from obsidian you have a chance so i presume it's really really low that you're gonna get it uh let's place everything nope we're gonna take on the higher vendor that way it costs less so level two here, right? And a lot of resources in here. Let's take this out and put this in. And this, I think, for the glowing essence. So let's craft 10 of these. And then uh, we need glowing essence and brimstone for these. So let's put in the brimstone again. And then let's craft up, what was it? Yeah, let's craft up all the glowing essence we can. What are we short on? Glowing goop. I do believe we have some more. Uh, we do want uh, as much as possible uh, that we can get. I will uh, eventually when I get the... I have some uh, glowing sticks in here. So what do we need? Just a witch spider. Uh, right. Okay, and then iron, 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 iron... We should have some iron somewhere in here. There we go. Let's take out a couple. Let's put them here, in here already. There we go. And then, oh yeah, we needed more glowing goop. Let's take out a couple more. There we go. 
because uh, yeah the build that I plan to create today actually needs multiple lights can you guess what I am gonna create what what place would require multiple lighting sources nobody uh, maybe if I turn it on it would actually start crafting yeah that kind of makes more sense so glowing goop let's take out some brimstone probably not gonna need so much and it's 200 a pop so uh, eight more that would make 20 uh, that would make 10 10 uh, so do want some more actually how many can we craft now six more at yeah, 26 that's 13 13 that should be a good start yeah uh, do you guys have any idea which type of building that I could build that actually would require us to have multiple lights? Come on, take a, take a guess. Let's put all the, well, not all the brimstone because we still need it. And tar. Uh, do we have a, a location for tar? I do have some uh, gold dust and silver dust, but I haven't really farmed it up. Let's put the tar in here. Uh, still still no guesses still still not figured it out what we're gonna build well I was thinking like okay we have dancers and we have multiple dancers in this game but what else do we actually where else do you go to dance like there's there's like one place where you definitely go well there's two places you definitely go to dance right well I would go there to dance and that's one a festival but festivals are outside so if we're not gonna build a festival inside what place else except for a bar uh, we already have a couple dancers at the bar but they are gonna move because um, a bar has some music and if you're really really drunk then yeah you could dance in a bar but what place really really has dancers come on guys think about it I know you I know you can guess it I know you can guess it. So let's craft up these already. Can we put in some more? Yeah, we're gonna need to wait for the glowing essence to be done before we can. I'll I'll come back down once that's all ready and crafted up and we're actually ready. What place do you go to dance? A dancing, a discotheque. So yeah, today's build, we are actually gonna build a discotheque. I wanna uh, build a place where I can... Well, we're gonna need to farm up a lot of dancers, because there's a lot of people at dancing, most likely. But yeah, I'm gonna build a dancing or a discotheque today. Uh, it's gonna be the next floor. And there's some other build that we have not even considered uh, taking. Uh, and thinking about, like, our, our people are eating and drinking a lot. But they're still missing a place to actually go to the toilet. <laughs> so I'm thinking that maybe later on, not in today's episode, but maybe later on we actually want to build a toilet. Maybe some restrooms in a couple places that people can actually, well, take a dump, take a leak, right? Uh, it's, it's only a natural course. So as you can see, I've set up the room already and still misplaced. Can we get rid of this one? we most likely can there we go so I've set up the next floor as you can see and I've made some balconies cuz well yeah if you're hot and you're kind of tired of the loud loud music well by my well I do like I don't know if you guys do but I do you want to go outside and actually take a little rest get your breath and then uh, come back in start dancing again so I did make some doors uh, just actually to set off the build that were not really straight on all the lines. Uh, but I did leave a couple walls open and this is actually the middle part. Now I've been thinking about this really hard because we have one here, two here and then two here. Uh, so I'm actually doubting if I don't want to like we have one, two, three walls, one, two and then this wall. If I shouldn't like close off this wall and this balcony and then just use like this area completely around here uh, towards here to actually set up a place where our band because a discotheque has or a DJ or a live performance band uh, and as we have no record players in this game 
I'm um, kind of forced to make a band. Uh, so yeah, it would, uh, now that I actually think about it, it would look way better if we would actually make it around here that we could have a couple singers up the front and then the bands in the back and the side. Uh, I kind of wanted to build like when uh, between these, but I'm kind of obstructed with this one because uh, well it's straight and not aligned and that way it doesn't really doesn't really look that good right so yeah we are gonna set up and destroy most likely this balcony and these walls I'll do that probably off camera uh, but we are gonna set up oh, where did I leave my chest I do need my chest with my building blocks so yeah, uh, what do artists need? They need a stage to perform on. So let's take out some walls. We're definitely not going to need 41. Let's destroy this. And let's take in some brick. And let's take out some foundations. Can I carry everything? Perfect. So if we look at our structure, our stage would actually start here. Like we don't want our NPCs to be able to touch the artists. Uh, so setting up, should we do it in brick or do we want to go for sandstone? Like I'm always contemplating these things. Like what does what does look the best? What what looks uh, looks like kind of plain? What kind of doesn't look too plain? Uh, these are the questions that are on my mind constantly, so we need to go one out, then one straight. No, not like this. One straight. One s that one, and then one. Let's go to the inside. Well, mm, we can crawl on there, right? So let's go on the wall. And let's do our stage area. So like this, and then kind of close it off and then two more oh it's two on that side and only one on this side where did I ah look at that already made mistakes already made mistakes so it's like this then like this and then like this and then that one and then we do need to break up the last part here and again we Demolishing some building blocks. I have demolished so much in this game just because I placed it wrong. Let's get back on here. I hope it doesn't get too dark so you guys can keep looking as I'm building up this place. So let's make sure that all our buildings... Are you not going to snap for me? Like this and then like this. Seriously, is it not going to snap? Do I need to do that one first? It's possible that I need to do this one first before I can actually snap these. Yeah, now they actually snap. So let's do it like this. Straight one here. Straight one here. And these are all triangles. Because when I was uh, heading back home, I was actually like really thinking about it. Like, it would be really nice if the drums, the horn, and the gong actually... Because that's basically the only three instruments we have in this game, right? That they actually would have a slot for NPCs to place in. And that among the NPCs... Again, I'm coming up with so many NPCs. Um, that actually among the NPCs that we have, we have performers. But performer is just such a... It's a generic word, right? Like it, 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 it means so much. Like uh, a singer is a performer, a dancer is a performer, a DJ is a performer, uh, a guitar player, a, or a guitarist, or a drummer are performers. Like they're all different kind types of performers. So it'd be really, really nice if we actually had like uh, NPCs we could set in our, uh, in our well, in our drums and in our horns and in our gongs it's yeah like i said it's the only three oh and we had the stygian drums haven't built those yet and they do look like better not gonna need that many let's put these back and these back half of them each still not enough mm, let's do more 
still not enough. Let's do... Let's get rid of two. That should be enough. There we go. Now we can actually walk. So the front stage, we're gonna have a singer. And then... How are we gonna do this? Like two horns, maybe? Oh, horns are kinda big. Uh, let's do... One drummer over here. And one drummer over here. Actually, at the front, you usually have the guitarists, right? But we don't have guitars in this game, so it's gonna be drums. And then we would have two horn players. Um, it's kind of hard to see, actually. It's kind of hard to see. I'm going to quickly reload, guys, that I have lights and daytime. And that's going to make it easier to make sure that it's uh, set up properly. So I'll, I'll be right back. All right, now that we have some lights, let's do... Let's put the horn right, right on the edge here kind of looks good and then one Ooh, yeah that's we're gonna need to replace the other one yeah we are gonna need to replace the other one because it's I, I can't uh, turn it that it's the other way around so I kind of need to set them up that they do look uh, semi the same but not the same uh, let's get rid let's scroll in and let's get back so we actually can see the floor and not be obstructed by our dude's face so let's snap it towards the middle here and then make sure it aligns with the wood that way it's always placed properly in the middle something like come on come on something like this right how does that look so one npc can stand here one npc can stand here and then we have our gongs so let's do are we gonna place them like this yeah let's do one here and one here kind of in the middle and then we have our drum player and he's gonna need a lot of drums so let's start with two in the middle my cousin actually plays the drums so I'm really I'm, I'm not really sure how many drums. Well, I think he has like eight or nine and a couple cymbals and then all the ramatam that comes with it. Uh, but I don't really know that much about drums. But we're going to set up a lot of drums. Because uh, how did we... Oh, we did cross towards this line, I do believe. Come on. Something like this. And then... This should be big enough. Let's twist it to touch the edge. And then one more here. Yeah, our drummer can go nuts. Yeah, he can he can actually go nuts. Like this is a this is a, a nice area, right? Like some a drum player, two horn players, some cymbal players, and then the light drum players and then we have a little stage area where our singer can like walk around a little bit and enjoy our crowd so that's basically our stage area doesn't really look that bad but it do like it is the same as the wall so I'm thinking about actually having to set it up in a different type of wall maybe the stone again um, I was doubting at the uh, at our uh, catwalk, if I don't think I have any stone, they're gonna be outside. So we wanna have some tapestries. Uh, let's get the walls in here. So we break down these. Yeah, let's break down these. Now I don't hope that the ceiling is gonna collapse on us. Um, let's break down the door. That's not gonna be a good one. What the hell came down? Did the entire... F yeah, everything came down. Crap. Okay, I'm gonna remove this uh, wall really quick. Reset it. I think some blocks on the roof will collapse as well. So I'm gonna need to run around a little bit. Uh, that's not something I want to entertain you with. I want to set up the room. That's the episode from the day. Not how you build walls. <laughs> so I'll be right back, guys, once I finish this. It finished. There was only two triangles disappeared. But yeah, now it kind of, if we look at the middle of the stage, actually, it has a door there and it has a door there. 
So kind of looks more, well, the same on both sides. This, this really, this is pleasing to the eye. Like there's no, there's no difference. Uh, and well, the stage always, as far as I know, the stage is always at the middle of the, of the hallway. Uh, now, we do want to have dancers at the front, but people who are tired, they actually want to like just stand, like uh, have a drink. So we do need to put up some tables. Let's do a table here, there, and there. And then that's between the first two. So yeah, we actually only have one here, one here, and one here. So now we have people that can actually put away their drinks and talk a little bit away from the crowd. Um, I wonder if I should do also like smaller tables here where people can actually put up their drinks. But then I need straight tables. Don't have those on me. Uh, we do want some candles on the tables. So let's put in no straights, just stubs. Stubs look uh, kind of better. Let's put a black one here. A black one here and then a white here where's the first black one good place and then on the other tables we're gonna switch it around like a white one here let's twist and bob it white one here and a black one in the middle there we go so we have a little mood lighting around the table uh, we do need some banners of course uh, let's do one banner here and one here and then we do have enough to place these two like this and like this Ooh. Mm. yeah not happy about that remove and remove let's place the blue ones in the middle like this and then these ones do need to have this one. So we have uh, those there, blue ones in the middle, those here. And then we have... Damn, they look the same. Well, it's, it's red. So actually we need a bigger banner here. Let's put up some banners behind the artists. Um... Let's scroll in so we can actually see. Uh, let's do one at this corner and then one at that corner. Uh, we did reach the top, right? Yep, we reached the top. There we go. And one in the middle, maybe? Like lower? Yeah, that way they're not aligned. This, this kind of already looks better. So we have our tapestries up. We have some mood tapestries and then well, now that I did relock, um, I kind of have to wait till it's dark to actually see what we... Uh, glowing standard lights, the glowing wall torch, and what else am I missing? Uh, some drinking horns, some iron mugs, and some iron tankards. Because people do go towards our bar and get drinks, of course. Nobody wants to dance and then be... Like standing there with a dry mouth. Uh, let's do two tankards, an iron mug, and there. Let's do all here and one here. And then one here. Oh, that's not what I wanted to pick. A tankard. We don't want all the tables to. Like something like this. Not all the tables need to be filled. Mm, this one is kind of empty. A lot of people have been drinking here. Uh, let's switch up with some other tankards. Oh, well, are we going to place them on top? Yeah, well, some people always... Well, I know that I did when I was younger. Like, place cans on top of each other. To see how high you can build before it uh, trips. That's what I... Well, it's one of the things when I did when I was drunk. <laughs> So, the lighting, let's place these back in here. Let's run downstairs. Let's see if we can make up the other lights. As I said, like, a dancing usually has different types of lights. And, uh, well, yellow is one of them, but the yellow lights actually shine a little hard. So, I'm 
I'm hoping that they don't shine too hard. And we're almost downstairs. And Geronimo! And... Over there, right? And over here. Yeah, no, no, no. We do need to grab it first before we can craft it. And it was this one. Yeah, glowing Essence, Witch Fighter Power, 19. And let's already take those. Uh, 9. We should be able to craft up some lightings. I really do hope that they're not too much alike. Uh, as I said, I want different types of lights. Uh, so let's do... Four of these and then five of these. They should be really quickly done. The tankards we're gonna put in this box. There we go. Let's fill up our drinks again. We're gonna need to stay dehydrated. Really important. And then glowing stands. This one can go in here. Summon witch fire. Oh, we actually haven't really checked out our journey right so we're missing throw an orb well we did that but it's kind of bugged earn a perk you've certain that you have figured out will help you're certain that what you have figured out will help you survive for long perhaps even give you the edge in a crucial situation it feels good mm, it's kind of black so kind of wondering if it's bugged or not uh, chapter 5 you do have decorate yourself with war paint fire a trebuchet Combine orb effects, climb the Tower of Bats. The Tower of Bats? Hmm. Now a lot of these, a lot of these. Oh, we even did Chapter 10. Create a Master Workstation. Equip Epic Armor Set. Did we equip an Epic Armor Set? When did we equip our Epic Armor Set? Hmm. Okay. And one more. Put these in here, these in here, and there's the last one. Okay, let's see what the lighting looks like, and then later on we can, if we can craft up, if we get go enough gold ore and silver ore, uh, we can actually craft them up or grind them up to dust, and then make the gemstones. Was it, was it gemstones? I think it was gemstones, right? Uh, we can craft the gemstones and then put in some other types of light because this is basically two times blue. Okay, it's getting dark. This is actually perfect. So let's see. Let's see. One here. Oh, that's actually pretty light. That's that's maybe two lights for my liking. Uh, what do these do? Ah, these are actually, they're really light as well, but it's for the back, right? Now I'm wondering that everything is going to light up too much. Oh, no, no, those are perfect. Those are actually perfect. So let's place them in the middle here. One here, one here. This is so not placed in the middle. Well, it's in the middle of the wall so let's one here and then one where did I place that other one okay in the middle next to the door so next to the door that should be this one I am thinking of removing this one because that's really can't return to seriously glowing standing torch well dismantle then that's kind of harsh because we want to have mood lighting, we don't want to have... Uh, let's do this one here then. Yeah, that's more... That's more. Uh, it's like a lighter essence. I kind of wish it turned blue, like... it. it, it it's kind of too light for me to actually... Because I'm, now I'm thinking about the... Oh, and I can return this one? Why can't I return the other ones? They were damaged, but what does it mean to be to have damaged lights? So one here, and then one here, something like this. And let's see, five, do one in the middle, like that, and one on this side as well. Oh, I don't have them anymore. Crap! Because these kind of look look good, right? It's kind of greenish, and that's kind of bluish. 
Yeah, it's not it's not that bad, but I'm gonna have to craft up a whole lot more. So two blues there, two blues over there. And a green one here, green one here. Where did I put that other blue one? Here. Uh, return to inventory. So green one again here. Let's do the last one that I have here. And our dancer. That way we have three lights like that. And then a green one here. And a green one here. Yeah, it kind of—it's kind of lighting up the place, but it's—it's it's not. Is it—is it—is it dawn again? Is it dawn again, or is it turning light? Is the night already over? Did I miss the night? Uh, so let's do green, green. We have double greens on this side. Yeah, I kind of want to keep this one reddish, and then on this side as well. Yeah, I think we're kind of done with our. I kind of expected it to give like different lights and not just like white lights in the background because they are giving giving white light right white light right okay yeah I think it's morning already so we can't really see the visuals of it crap now I wish I had done some more farming and already went to the volcano so what else do we need? We're gonna need some NPCs, right, to fill in the spots where we want our, uh, well, our music, our artists, and we want some dancers. I think I have some dancers down in my box as well. Didn't I? Didn't I have some dancers still in the box? Check it out. I think it's over here. Last box. Nope. Third last box. Uh, open, please. Thank you. Uh, priest, priest, priest. Lemurian dancer. Only one. So, carpenter, carpenter, blacksmith, archer, level 3, archer, level 1. Archer, level 1. Fighter, level 1. Uh, what else? Cook. We can't place the cook. Can't place the priest. These are all. Yeah, we kind of need to see how they look. I don't want to place the same people. The crowd of dancers can be the same, but the artists can't be the same. Um, don't know if that kind of makes sense, but yeah, in a big crowd, there's always like some faces that kind of look alike. But unless it's twins, uh, a band of twins, we could do that, a band of twins. Like plays all... We have double instruments, so... And then make the singer and the drummer something else. And make the horn player and the gong player actually different NPCs. We could do something like that. So where is our stage? Let's see. Um, oh, yeah, right. We have one dancer. So fighter is a dude. Let's put the dude behind the drums. Something like this and then we have a female and what is level three? Oh, it's two different females so that's pretty good let's have a gong player here and then somebody behind the horn like this can't place overlapping with an object are you overlapping with me oh, I can't place some close oh I think we're gonna place it like this and then we only need uh, a singer, a male singer. Well, we could do a male singer, right? So a male singer here, and then people who dance. Uh, I'm gonna pull out the two dancers in our bar, and I do presume that we are gonna need to farm up a whole lot more dancers because I wanna have my dancing kind of filled up. Same with the bar. Uh, we still need to look. We have found another named NPC. Uh, and she came across... No, don't dismantle. No. Can't I interact with you? Move. Let's move this one. Oh yeah, we can uh, make one follow, right? Uh, that's the same one. And you can follow me. Is she gonna follow me up the stairs? Now that's the question. 
Come on, come on. Are you gonna follow me up the stairs? Is she smart enough? She's smart enough. There's a way better place to dance with way better music. Come on. Yeah, she's actually smarter than I than I thought. Like she's actually using the stairs properly. Yeah, there is no, there's no. Well, there isn't a little edge, but come on, come on. Up we go. Yeah, we could have taken the elevator. Not sure if you use the elevator with an NPC that she actually uh, goes up with it or gets stuck in it. Not really sure. Weapon room. Come on. Ah, oh, she stopped following me. Come on, miss. Really? She already heard the music. Stop following. And... I can only do stop following. Hmm, this is kind of strange. Uh, let's do. Oh, and now she's actually following me. Let's do one here. There we go. And where is that male one? Did I leave it in the in the middle of the catwalk, or is he still downstairs? Because I didn't actually place him right. I I kind of switched him. Hmm. Where are you, dude? Where are you? Did you went back to the bar? Yeah, he's back in the bar. Let's move you. That's faster than following. There we go. I thought we had a named dancer, a named performer. Where is where is she or he? I'm wondering about a lot of stuff today. Not all, really. Wait, what? Then we place Ah, oh, she's still on the move. Okay, she's still she's still moving. So let's do him over twist it, pop it, turn it. There we go. So one here. And you stop following. And move. And then let's place her here. Are you gonna start dancing? Yeah, she's gonna start dancing. So yeah, guys, we... Well, it's a start. We it, It's not... Is she still moving? Is she still following? Stop following me. Are you still following me? She's still following me. Uh, guess I'm gonna need to log off to make her stop following me. Not sure if that actually works. Yeah, we have our first three dancers. We kind of have, um, well, I'm, I'm a musician crew and a, and a singer. Um, so yeah, we have our start. Well, it's not start. The building is kind of, kind of not complete. I do want other lighting in here, like the red lights. And if they actually give off red lights, I'm gonna do more red lights than I'm gonna do other lights. But yeah, our dancing is kind of, kind of complete. Our next floor is actually. Um, realized so yeah that's gonna wrap it up for today guys I'm probably gonna do some dancer farming today in the different locations that we have so I can fill up this dancing or discotheque whatever you like to call it a little more and hope you enjoyed the episode I'll see you in the next one bye bye